Hey guys, it's Tell with Oshawa Bushcraft. Um, I had a few members on Blade Forums uh, spot the sheath I've been wearing in my videos and asked to see uh, to have a closer look at it. So I'm putting this video together mostly for them. Uh, this is the sheath I made for my BK2. Uh, it is uh, probably eight, 10 ounce veg tan leather, uh, just a standard clamshell uh, style sheath. Uh, I did put a liner in it to keep the knife from uh, cutting through the stitching. And I hand sewed this myself with um, a strand out of uh, the paracord lining. I planned on using wax thread, but at the last minute I couldn't find any. Um, the belt sheaths I put in the back here, the, the belt loops, I don't know if you can make this out. This is the one I'm normally using when I'm carrying it on my right side. And the purpose of this one is that the knife sits down just slightly below my belt level so it doesn't interfere with the Swedish pack you see me wearing. But I wanted to give myself some options so I included a second belt loop here. I don't know if you can make it out but there's one row of stitching here and another row down here and this is a second belt loop that's for carrying it on my left side. Now the purpose of putting this higher up and making it so much bigger is that it'll sit loose on my belt so I can move it around. So if I'm wearing it on my left side I'm still probably going to draw it with my right but I'm going to need it up a little higher so I can get at it. I'm going to want to be able to turn it a little bit to draw it across to my right. Whereas when it's on my right side, I'm going straight up. So that was it. I didn't want to make this thing. I had all sorts of fancy ideas in my head and all sorts of grand stuff. But uh, I wanted to keep it simple. It's supposed to be a bushcraft knife sheath. And all it needs to do really is hold my knife to my belt. Uh, I wanted all sorts of pouches and options for mounting it all over the place, but that's all I really needed to do. I added a fire steel that I actually put on the back of the sheath, not at the front, because I use the one on my keychain most of the time anyway. This is actually there as a backup. It's another redundancy. Uh, after I finished it, I soaked it in, uh, what did I use again? Neat's foot oil. And then uh, a couple of days later, I had somebody install one rivet down here for me because I didn't have a rivet setter. And I was just worried about uh, pushing the knife into the sheath and having it poke right through the bottom of my sheath. So I put that rivet in there. But uh, I think what really qualifies this as a bushcraft sheath is that other than the rivet, I made this with what I carry in my repair kit. Uh, the cordage, the needle, I did all the cutting with my Tenacious. Uh, theoretically, I could make this in the field. So there you have it guys. Bushcraft BK2 sheath made total time maybe an hour.